Guys, if you're watching this, make sure you subscribe. If you want to watch the whole thing, you can watch it on YouTube, Apple Podcasts or Spotify. Welcome back to another episode of Saving Grace. Today's episode is the one that's going to ruin me. People will no longer come up to me and say, I love you. They will laugh in my face. It is the episode of my parents. Say hello. 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 But before we go any further, I think we have a little surprise for you, Grace. I actually don't know what is going on right now, so I'm a bit nervous. (laughs) We're taking over the podcast. Are you? Yeah, we're going to expose you. I'm scared of what it is. Ella's laughing. (laughs) What is it? What is it? Ooh, disgrace. (laughs) Shut up. Oh, here we go. Shut up. What? Now, Gracie. I thought it was like an amputee because the arm stopped there. <laughs> there we are. No, because you used a great picture as well, I have to say. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, how, how airbrushed is that? Yeah, uh, very, thank you. <laughs> Rude. Cool. No, why do I love it? Imagine me taking that back on the train with me. <laughs> no, don't worry, we're going to sling it out the car window. <laughs> I quite <laughs> like it. Yeah, shove it back there. Oh, the, the difference of what I actually look like. Well, this is what we're going to say. <laughs> Dylan, Dylan say that. Thank you very much. Oh, she's a stunner. Anyway. She, anyway. Rude. <laughs> You're in flesh and blood. Some airbrushed woman. <laughs> Kim Kardashian. Right, Kim Kardashian. Without the butt. <laughs> Who is that? <laughs> Am I really going to Right, so. Without the butt. We're g- that was out of pocket. <laughs> yes, yeah, good. That was out of pocket without the butt. Are you saying you've got flowers? What? What? <laughs> We're going to start <laughs> with the story. I've already been violated. It's only 30 seconds in. <laughs> uh, right. Dad, basically, we're going to do some stories up to my age now that have been really tragic and have proved why I'm this mentally unstable. Uh, and I'm obviously blaming my parents. Oh, it's a bit rough, don't you? Right. Gosh, you've got to speak into the mic. You can't go like that. Well, no, I was talking you. to him. Well, oh, yeah, but I can't hear you. Right, okay. Right. Well, I think that's a bit rough then. Right. <laughs> First one. Go for it, Dad. Ooh. Take ah. the wheel. When you and I met, <laughs> I know you said we can't talk about poop on your podcast, but yeah. when you and I met, the relationship was all about poop. It's too bleeding late. Yeah. Yeah. Go your, on. Your mom and your actual dad yep. asked me to babysit, and I never forgot that. You were one year old. I was. And... He did the biggest poop I've ever he seen. He did, or I did? You did. <laughs> oh, he, he, went you did. he did the biggest poop. I was like, yeah. wow. You, I walked into the room. As soon as your parents left, you, you just pooped your nappy, and it was the biggest poop and the smelliest one. Thank you. Well, and I think from there night. on, you always thought it was funny because you thought I overreacted, but I actually was gagging, and I was <laughs> retching. But I had to change it. It was, it was terrible. It, it was bad. <laughs> <laughs> and it never improved. That's the whole thing. Right through and up to last night, you traumatized <laughs> me. But anyway. That's a lie. It's not. No, it's, it's not, not a lie. It's, it's not, not a lie. lie. Don't say anything. <laughs> um, <laughs> You're not allowed to talk about that. <laughs> Let's carry on. Right. So that moves you on to what you had to do when I did used to do a poo. Oh, yeah. Changing, changing your nappy. That was always... Did you hear him change my nappy? Um, I had to go out the room because it was so bad. Right. Yeah. So what? Mum did what she always did. She just disappeared. She <laughs> yeah. Always had something to do. All of a sudden. All Part-time time. mum when I'm pooing. Oh, the phone's going. I gotta answer the phone. The phone uh, Andrew, could you change Grace's nappy? Yes, you always did it. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't. You did. You did. I might have done what? You did. So where does the uh, hose? When we were living in the Virgin Islands, so we uh, mum used to go off quite often. Uh, she would go into town, do shopping or whatever it was, and or go up for coffee with the girls, and then I'd have to take care of you. And what she didn't know was I got fed up with changing your nappies the regular way. I'd get you to stand in a black bin liner, <laughs> drop the nappy, and then te- get, step out of the bin liner, go onto the grass, and then I'll hose you down. In front right. of all my neighbours. In front of the neighbours. You were a strange child. Anyway. They saw my bare you. ass. He didn't do it quite like that because he used to say, being a firefighter, he used to say, step away. <laughs> so he used to drop, drop the nappy in and he'd say, step away, Grace. And you did. And I did, yeah. There was a lot of retching involved too. <laughs> <laughs> still do that. I think I it was up to last night, actually. Yeah, still that, doing Can we stop with this? All right, right. yeah. We're, we're meant to be when I'm two. So, how old are you now? 23. Oh, oh we're right. missing the two. That's yeah. all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No nappies were involved last night. No, thank you. Okay. Um, 
downward leg. Oh, yes. That was a classic. So, so we were still abroad. Yeah, we were still in Tortola. Yeah. And you, I thought, this child's a prodigy because I love <laughs> exercise. Well, you can't tell now, but I did. <laughs> yeah. And Grace uh, came outside and I thought she was doing a downward leg, you know, downward like five leg raise or something. Yeah. I, I can't figure out what it was. It looked mm. like a yoga pose to me. Turns out she started to wee on the wall and then looked at me and said, look, dad, I'm peeing just like Bowser. You got to explain who Bowser is. Yeah, but the Buster. pet dog. Buster. Oh, it Buster. was Buster. Yeah, it was Buster. Yeah, it was Buster. Yeah. yeah. So I pissed on the wall dogs. in front of everyone. Yeah, in front Helen of everyone. There. Just wee down there? the wall. No, no was this in... was one of my coffee mornings. Yeah. yeah, it was a coffee morning. Yeah, yeah. sounds yeah. about right. Uh, it was one of my, mm. I think, oh, nipples. You didn't even ask me and you got slumped with me all the time. Yeah. Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> <laughs> still to this day. Yeah, still to this day. Is I don't Helen know there? what I've done wrong. Well, I know I did a lot wrong. I saved you on life, toilet but... paper that day, though. So yeah. if anything, I was helping you out. I knew living crises were going to increase in the next few years. And I thought, let me help Entertain them. you. Yeah. Yeah, was that Robbie Williams? To. Oh, toilet paper was really cheap there in the for a Virgin minute. Islands. Uh? You didn't need to. Toilet paper was really cheap in the Virgin Islands. Yeah. Um, oh, wait. Is this when the goat, should we do the goat one? You can do the because goat one Because this is when like. it happens. Well, the goat so, one. So, yeah, you say, you say, and then you say. Well, I got to start it off yeah. because I was sort of there first seeing it. Yeah, right. So, simply, we lived, as you know, we lived on right on the beach. Yeah. And uh, one day I was in the kitchen and the, the sort of window looked out and I saw this black ball bobbing like like a sort of head bobbing out in the distance and I thought there's a Hawaii Five O moment coming on I can feel it I called to Andrew Drew I think there's someone in the water so of course off he went da, 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 da. Yeah. <laughs> slow-mo yeah slow-mo yeah out he went he first of all rushed into the water he swam out there well it was a bit of a way wasn't it and he, only to find it was a... It was a goat. In was difficulty. A, but yeah. there was a dog that chased the, the goat out into the water. behind the goat. Oh. Chasing the goat. So it was chasing the goat. So then what happened? So I had to bring the goat back in. With and one arm. The dog started still going at the goat. So I had to hold the dog in one hand and the goat in the other hand and then do a... Well, it wasn't actually a backstroke. It's a, you know, a leg paddle. paddle backwards. Get them back to shore, and then we gave the goat to, to our neighbour. No, no, and this is where the story gets confused. You didn't give the goat to our neighbour. We woke up one morning and said, "Where's the goat?" And you went, "Do you smell that? That's the goat." They made it into a goat curry. They did yeah, eat well, it. Yeah, they, they made it into a curry. They did eat it, but they had oh, more pet. than they bargained for because the I goat was pregnant. I so thought they were take, oh, Jesus Christ. I thought they were going to take care of the goat. They, they yeah. You goats. thought they were going to take care of the goat? Yeah, yeah they, they do. Go it. every week, surely. Well, no, no. I think that one, because it was in the seawater and all that yeah. salt. It, Seasoning. Properly seasoned. Yeah. So That's they disgusting. Said, anyway, they ate it. That's why I've got trust issues. We had to give our bloody dog away as well. This is why I am the way I am. We had to give the dog away. Oh, yeah, and but the, cat. the dog did not end up in a curry pot. No. no. Just remember that. No. That was all the other animals when, that we had. Yeah. yeah. Did you hear how we got the dog? No. That didn't bloody drown as well, did it? Well, it got thrown <laughs> in the sea with a weight round its neck. Oh, and he was so strong. More, it Jesus was a pit Christ. bull and he was so strong that he managed to keep afloat. And then Andrew spotted him and you rescued him, didn't you? Yeah. And then we took him home. And that's when we took him home. Oh, yeah. He's dead now. Yeah, he's uh, dead now. Yeah. Next question. <laughs> so we got the I not. Oh. Oh, yes. Yeah. You went through uh, about, I would think, about a year and a half of anything we asked you to do, you'd go, I not. It wasn't uh, that. It was high pitched. I not. That yeah, was it was like that. I not. Right. It was that. Yeah. So I, all I did was to get you to stop, but I changed your name to I not. So I stopped <laughs> calling you Grace and I said, I not. Can you. um. Clean your room up. I not. Can you go have a wash? <laughs> yeah, but you all there, have then. weird wick name, wick names, <laughs> wick nicknames, nicknames for me. Do tell each your nickname for me. You got a few. Thank you for today's sponsor of the podcast, Hello Fresh. 
as you all know, I can't cook by myself. I lived at uni. Uh, I basically nearly starved to death if it wasn't for HelloFresh. They sent me a massive box and it basically comes with all of the ingredients, step by step on how to do it. And it just basically plans your meal for the rest of the week. So you don't have to worry about anything if you're onto more important things like partying. My favourite meals that they gave me in the box were the smoky patatas bravas uh, and the chicken creamy pasta bake. Uh, I live off pasta, so that was the one for me. This is good for people that don't really know where to start with cooking or if you just can't be bothered to sort it out yourself, it all comes for you. And I've also learned how to cook with all the new ingredients uh, and I'm not living off pasta all the time anymore. Sort of, I kind of am, but it's on the HelloFresh box, so it's fine. To get 50% off of your first HelloFresh box and 35% off your next free, use the code GRACE50. So again, for your first free box and your next three for 35% off, use the code GRACE50. Well, mostly maggot. Maggot. Grape. Yeah. Grape. Grape. Juice. Grape juice. Grape juice. Um, well, I'm, I'm clug, wug, and if well, it depends how cluggy. good you are. If yeah, first call it was cluggy. Yeah, but if you're naughty, it's waggy. Oh my god, <laughs> I'm so mad. <laughs> I felt a Scooby Doo moment no. coming. On. Oh, <laughs> I should have said Scooby yeah, but Snacks. We're in like normal, busy places, and she, she goes clug, wug, and I'm like, what are you actually doing? But you turn around. <laughs> That's the laugh. Yeah. You yeah. don't keep walking, Grace. Yeah, you don't keep like, walking. <laughs> That's so embarrassing. I don't even know. Why did you call me maggot? Um, I don't know. <laughs> he just... was remembering the poos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's probably the poos. No, I just came up one day. I don't know why. Can you love it that one? You really like that. <laughs> you can't make yourself and laugh. I just call you maggot do? from my own. Yeah, yeah. But Aww. now we do call you Grace a bit more. Only or when you're disgrace. annoyed at me. Eh? You only call me that when you're annoyed at me. Well, you actually do. Time, then, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, yeah. I've got one question. To it. It's not related to all of this. All right. Well. Yeah. Why the chairs? Because they look. They just remind me of Superman. Right. No. This Christopher is the Reeves. Chris. Chris <laughs> Christopher Reeves. He had his neck broken. Any, anybody know who Christopher Reeves is? He has neck so broken. So they. An I told them people keep calling me Stephen Hawking, <laughs> and they strongly agreed, but more Christopher Reeves style. Yeah, the chairs. Look so good. these chairs, as soon as I get a new set, they're being burnt. I think you should. I should think we should have them at home. Have them in the garden. Imagine us eating our dinner on these chairs. <laughs> Andrew, pass us out. <laughs> Clug, pass us out. Oh man. God, please. Right, next question. <laughs> oh wait, or did you want to go on to the gloves? Oh, gloves. Yeah, better have gloves. Gloves. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's just, uh, you, you you couldn't say they were gloves, but I think a lot of people can't do that when they're younger. But I think what was different with us was I really tried to get you to say gloves. So yeah. we used to sit once a week on the kitchen table and get a box of gloves out. Not literally out. on the kitchen yeah, table. Yeah, the we'd get a box of gloves out on the kitchen table and I'd take them out one by one and get you to say gloves. I would say gloves and you would just repeat gloves. And it, this would carry yeah, on. Yeah, but I had no for front quite teeth. quite a while, though. It went on for quite... I oh. didn't have any front teeth. I've got a picture of your teeth, Grace. They came with receipts. I, I have got didn't a picture of your teeth. And how do we spell teeth? No. All right. To it ever. Right. <laughs> <laughs> now, look, Grace. This is the yeah, gap. Yeah, but my it was, Mind if, the gap. No, but as Mind if this gap. wasn't my fault, they'd go up to people. People I didn't even know, they'd go look like gravestones, don't they? <laughs> and I'd be like, ah. Oh? What the hell? They're huge. <laughs> they are huge. <laughs> they look like Stonehenge, and that's on a good day. <laughs> I need some composite bonding. Teeth, yeah, have yeah. I? Hey, have I? Yeah, grown oh, into my yeah. teeth. Yeah, I think you have yeah. grown into your I teeth, Butch. There's no answer to that. Right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> screw you. My uh, next one is. Oh, I feel like this is good. One? So we used to go on holiday to Trinidad a lot. And Tobago well, as well, Tobago. Oh, sorry, Tobago, Trinidad and Tobago. Yeah. Double T. And um, we, me and dad, mum, what would you be doing while we'd be going well, out Well, I thought I might stuff? find Sitting someone to have pool. a cup of coffee with, actually. Oh, <laughs> and leave you with dad. Yeah. You know, yeah. I might go for a quick swim or something. You can't you know. swim. We well, don't have to tell him that, Grace. <laughs> God's sake, it doesn't sound as good then. Right, so we one day, how old was I? Hey, how old was I? Uh, oh, was probably week. about. Well, we started going to Tobago when you were about eight. Uh, we came back to the UK when no, you were but five. during this situation, eight or nine, eight or nine, yeah, yeah, right. And to set the scene, 
I was wearing pink Crocs. Oh, yes. Light blue quarter length. Oh, no, yes, I remember that. Oh, yeah, so I remember those, the yes. golf club, yeah, golf yeah. cart. Yellow, oh, a yeah. yellow T-shirt. So basically, yeah. you could easily be seen. Yeah, like, I was so clapped. Like, it was so ugly. Gaps teeth. I think I had a bob at that point as well, did I? Yeah, it's did. not looking yeah. good, Grace. It's not yeah, looking good. I had, oh, yeah. look at oh, you. It's not looking good, bro. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, so me and Dad, we used to, when we would stay, we'd stay on like a golf thing, wouldn't we? Even though none of us play golf. Yeah. Yeah. So we Sat stayed on it. We stayed on a um like we a hired a sort of like a plantation y type villa on a golf course. And basically you could rent golf carts. Yeah. Yes. yes. I'll let you take the wheel. Yeah, you can rent the golf carts. Uh but you had to drive them partly on the road to get to your to Ooh. get to your villa. And Grace, uh you, you ended up you never liked alcohol. Don't know how you drink Not alcohol. Changed, no, yeah. you never liked alcohol. <laughs> I'd try to give you a sip of beer every now and then. But when you went to Tobago and you tasted carob for the first time, you were addicted. So you used to try used to, to steal a carob. And I'd try to get you one sip, but you would actually Take steal the a bottle out of the yeah. fridge and open it and drink it in your room and, and hide it. Okay, that's um, where my problems started. Oh, yeah. we, we were out in the golf club, in the golf cart, and we were picking up coconuts for making, you know, rum and coconut water for me for later. And then I had a full bottle of carob sitting in the golf cart. And you decided the only way you're going to get that is to leave me out there. When I got off the golf cart to go get a coconut, you jumped in the driver's seat, drove off with my carob, <laughs> Drinking the carob down as fast as you could. I had like one hand on I the wheel, trying, the other hand I'd do like six. I like, was trying yeah. to run behind you. You decided you ran out of, you know, the area that was not on the road. So you went on the road and then drove straight home. And then the police <laughs> saw you. <laughs> and they pulled up at the villa because they knew where you were going. You know, they, they pulled, pulled up us up on the road, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, but they yeah. pulled yeah. cars just watching. on the outside of where oh, we were yeah. staying. They pulled us up just before you got into the villa. They pulled you over. And uh, yeah, yeah, the stern they were mean. You had a they stern talking to a very Grace. stern word. Yeah, yes. but who wouldn't laugh at that? If I pulled over like an eight-year-old, I'd be like, "That's so look, funny." Look, if you look like that now, they wouldn't have minded. But you didn't look like that I then. Got off you had your great free. big gap teeth. Yeah. So you were, <laughs> you were there running after me, seeing the police, and you were like, <laughs> "She's over here, officer. She's <laughs> over here." I was, I, was, I was wondering whether to come over and own you or just run to the side and go by the no, pool. No, you were just... laughing. You were yeah, watching her laughing. squirm for a little bit. <laughs> yeah. But then we had that snake. Do you Ooh. remember the oh, snake? Yeah. Oh, my God. That was God. at the villa. What was it? We stepped... We, no, we, you and I walked same up. Same place, This same was a place. traumatic day because weren't we getting attacked it's by birds? It's all related. It's all related because... It's, I'm the issue. We then could no longer use the golf cart. <laughs> yeah, 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 you were banned. banned. You were banned. Because of you drinking beer and driving it on the road had a great time uh we ended up uh decided we'll walk to where the coconut trees are and get coconuts he steps him and while we were walking to get the coconuts we saw a snake and i started to say to you oh there's nothing to worry about but before i could finish that sentence <laughs> did she snake... do a goldie horn bit where she no, runs she like that really running <laughs> The, the I was snake. Mo Farah in that moment. There's no <laughs> yeah. way. This is a private Benjamin moment. Yeah, was... I'll be all right, Dad. Just a minute. <laughs> <laughs> it was more of a Hussein Bolt. Watch the gap teeth. It was getting closer. As clear. Your, the actual gap of your teeth was getting smaller and smaller as you was going faster and faster. <laughs> the crazy. wind was I've pushing never it seen, together. And not only that, the snake was actually chasing both of you. Yeah, yeah. the I, snake yeah. was chasing yeah. us. I was, now, I that was, was funny. I'll tell I you was, what, uh, that's what you needed on your sports days. I was about to say, you know, oh no, so you don't have to worry about them as long as you're not in their territory. <laughs> and then it just took off after us. <laughs> <laughs> we were both screaming. Did you hear us screaming yeah. before you saw us? That wasn't you, was it? Yeah, that, that was Or was great. that, that when was we were getting. I think that was you, Grace. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I think that, that, that was you. I don't think that was your father. I don't recall if that. It I is, would those just... trousers were far too tight. If that was you, screaming, I wouldn't <laughs> scream <laughs> after a little snake chasing. <laughs> no way. <laughs> right. Oh dear, oh next dear. one we have. Oh yes, What's this the next one, one. This is a good one because Mum was witness. Oh, yes. to this. Yes. So let me give some backstory. What's the next one? I've then? always been very lazy. This has never changed. No. So anything that I can do to make my life easier, yes, I absolutely will. Yes. So when I was younger, and to be fair, you caught me doing this the other night as well. I just won't take the towel out of the bathroom with me. I'll just. <laughs> walk naked uh it's, it's, like it's to my terrible, room it's a terrible yeah terrible. but to give when i was younger to give them a warning 
Actually, you can say. What was my warning? Oh, it was naked baby. You would scream but naked baby. But I would baby like scream it at the top of my lungs as like a siren. And shower into your room. He traumatized yeah. us, Grace. Mm. He's yeah. traumatized us. The whole, honestly, <laughs> I've never been the same since. Yeah, there was a wasp in mum's room wasn't, last night. It was a flat, she, yeah, was a flat she had a flat straight beetle. poor woman. <laughs> She was in her little night going, Andrew, Andrew, quick. You know, like, Andrew, going? we're not in Australia, you know. <laughs> Where'd you, you get don't even this? call him Andrew. I don't even you call him. You're going, Andrew, I know neighbours have <laughs> finished, but I know you're not in the oh, morning, are you? <laughs> it's true, PG Radio can't see what you call I me. think you're worried yeah. about, oh, yeah. God, Andrew. Yeah, I've got to try that one. You know, if I said it like that, he wouldn't bloody answer. He'd go, it's like you're someone strange. Yes. <laughs> No, you don't answer it. Neither of you answer. When I call from upstairs, you I know go, why, don't you? you can't it's bloody to do, hear in anything. the old days, it was hard to do with can I borrow, can you lend me, or <laughs> can you take me? So we used to go deaf. I'm an independent woman now, Mum. Yeah, so now we're saying, here, would you mind lending us? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm going, no, sorry. Yeah. yeah. Right. And this is why I never say anything because these two start talking all the time. You never get <laughs> one word in edgeways. Yeah, but you always act bored anyway whenever we're having a conversation. And the no, do you know what is bad away? about both of you? Too. No, this is what's bad. I will come in with some juicy tea. I will come in, I'll be like, this person's parents have just got divorced and she's had a child and she's also been blah, blah, blah. And they'll just be like, whatever. Yeah, they'll be like, all right. <laughs> and you, just, you just don't care. Well, I just want to know if you can hold a conversation without using the word like in it. No. <laughs> No, obviously not. Can you do it now? No. <laughs> like, go on, no. go on, give it a go. Yeah. <laughs> give me a tenner and I'll think about it. I've got that tenner. Yeah. Um, yeah, so there's quite a lot of stories, Grace. Yeah. Um, I think now we're moving on to when you were a bit older. Right, go on. I so know you want to flash the photos. I so think just we it. need to flash the photos purely because... Um, you brought quite a bit of photos there. She well, did. did. She's bought like paper. evidence. Hang on, I feel like I'm in court. bins on. Right, so now... We're going to do the obligatory... Not the small one. No one's going to be able to see that. Well, lucky for you. But I'm going to give it a go anyway. Right. So I like this... that one. That's oh, right. yes. That one's a good one. So the modern one. I know. Right. So now look. I haven't seen that photo see. ever before. No. Well, this is you in your I not I moment. Have a photo. This is you in the I not moment. Ugh, the denim jacket and the flares. Yes, yes. Who dressed um, me, Stevie this Wonder? This is what you the that... Gives your father a few touch of the nadgers because it could be the I other end. I don't know end. what you just said. What? <laughs> I don't know. Could be the other end, if meant. you know what I mean. Oh, right, okay. <laughs> now, this was your father bef before he came into our family. A, he had dark hair, and B, he had hair. Yeah. Now it's all green. <laughs> now it's now all look, green. Look, there. That, that was before yeah, he knew you, what he was getting into. Let me into. just say this. You could never do that now. If I walked around with my hair like that now, it'd be game over, mum. Be game over. Do you remember they always used to make uh, me yeah. cry when they did that? You looked evil in this one. Ugh, where am I? Oh, look at the size of my head. Yeah. Let look at see. the size of your head. Look at see. Mind oh, you the gap. Had a Mind the gap. See. You grew into your Yeah, you, you always grew said into I had a massive head, head. Grace. Oh, that's so ugly. I'm Jesus. not saying anything. And don't you remember the obligatory? I still uh, have a lazy eye. No, picture. that face there. That's that evil oh, face. Yeah, that's I the one. That. That's the one that used to hold on to my leg and look up at me and then oh, just poop a nappies. Yeah. You had an evil face. Thank you. So we've Shown done that. the big one with yeah. the teeth. Brilliant. Right? The big one with the teeth, mine the gap. I look like I play for England women's team. Uh there could be something in that. Yeah. Now, um, moving swiftly on, do you remember when we took you to meet the seal? Uh, you looked as if you were enjoying yourself, but I think you were very scared. Do you remember that? Can't hardly see it. When was this printed? 1921. What the uh, hell? Last night, No, actually. Mum, let me hang have on, it. Let's see, hang on a minute. I've got another one there. It was last night. Uh, do you remember that? I... Uh, I look like a bloke. I look like one of those guys that listen to heavy metal, you know, with the long hair. That's what Ooh, I look ZZ like. ZZ Top. I don't know who that is. <laughs> uh. And do you remember little Frederick? Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, yeah. little peacock. We used to have a peacock. No, that's weird, though, because I always used to think that was funny, but that's how they mate. What? You know, when they put all the feathers up and yeah. I was just sat there like talking to him and he's oh, trying to mate with me. little Fred. He yeah, thought you were going... Oh. That's weird. Tell me that's not weird. Mm. Oh, that's weird, all right. Yeah. He's an animal. He doesn't know what he's doing. He's Did you explain to, to everyone? Someone shot him. Yeah, someone shot the bastard. So if anyone... <laughs> 
Justice for Fred. Now look, Grace, trending. I I wasn't looking honestly, but I came across this photo and I just just I was compelled to show it. <laughs> Ella, have you seen that? <laughs> <laughs> Cal. I, like the I have never seen a producer laugh so much no, in all my life. No, that's so <laughs> disgusting. I look like something out of the Adams family. Well, well, can you pass it over? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Can't see. <laughs> yeah, but to get my hair cut like that also wasn't my idea. It's it was not, your idea. I, that was your idea to what? get my hair cut like that. Yeah, but I'm blind. You can't go anything I say. Uh, I think I think you need to get I am your haircut like so that again, embarrassed. Now look, I've got a better like one that. here. Brilliant. I've got a better one here. This is you. Now I actually can't tell who is the llama. Oh, you were the llama. <laughs> yeah, you did. You did I went llama, like llama trekking now, for look. my birthday. <laughs> she went llama trekking, and honestly, look, he's going. Oh, what mom, is going that was on there, ugly. Grace? The pair of you. Oh my God, is this when I had my brace? No, still no brace. I don't know what he was going on, but you two were clearly <laughs> liaising. What is that shirt? And then he spat on you, didn't he? No, he didn't spit on me. I know the llamas do. I don't they're think not, he spat they're on not me. The vibes, they spit. No, but do you remember we went into the shop after? It was just loads of llama memorabilia, like just loads of fluff yes, and stuff. And, and you've got the llama, the crocheted llama is still on your bed. That's so sad, isn't it? Crocheted llama. <laughs> you don't have to tell anyone, but it's still there. Yeah. Now, listen, I must say that when you became a nice bit more older little girl, Dad and I decided we were going to do up your bedroom. Do you remember? No, I'm really scared for what you're about to show. I don't know well, what you're about to show. I just want to explain to everybody um, that Grace has got a fair size bedroom. It's a double double sort of bedroom size. Isn't yeah, it? it's, it's, it's it fairly is. big room. Now, Grace, you decided to buy yourself a dressing table from a very well-known Scandinavian company who happened to do bloody good meatballs and chips. I won't go, yeah. I won't say who they are, but I yeah. think you know who I mean, don't yeah. you? Yeah. Anyway. Well, this is about the coconut oil, is it? Do we know another story about coconut well, that's oil? that's not a big deal. I just spilled coconut oil oh, on my don't desk. interrupt me. I'm on my oh, throat. sorry. Here. Anyway. So basically, that's not anybody, even a story. Normal, anybody normal, Grace, would get a nice little dressing table. Like this, a nice little dressing table. And oh, look, I will explain what they said on the thing. <laughs> There's plenty of space for makeup, jewellery in the two little small drawers and in the large drawer hidden underneath the dressing table. Voila. And I think they even give you a little demo. God, of could you what get it on with it? Like. What no, now? Grace, you've got to go with this one. And here we are. Now I'm going to show you what Grace's one looks like. That's a, yeah, that's on the same. Carry on about her room. Doesn't she? Look, oh, it's yeah. an obsession. Does anybody else Constantly. do the bloody thing? This is yeah. it. Look. So hang on, hang on. I'm yeah, it's that one. I think look. you should just get a lock for your door. Yeah, no one will give yeah. me a bloody lock. And you know what? Yeah. It's weird because when I go away, mum goes through my stuff. I do not. You do. Back me. Back me. Yeah. And then Throw look the at me, back me. No, but no roast potatoes I'll come you. home and my stuff is gone. Like my stuff it is just has gone. It's not great. My stuff is gone. One example of Have this. You been last in week, I came home. <laughs> I bought about so 40 like hangers back from uni. 40? No, it, I, back me up again. It was a lot. Uh, yeah. Right. Definitely. So I bought loads of hangers home because I knew I only had about 20 at home. Oh. What is 20? I carried the hangers yeah. up and down. Oh, the yeah. yeah. I carried them. Look. So there was loads, right? And I said, look, because I had to go away, I said, I'll put them in my wardrobe when I get back. Fine. I get back. I've hung up, what, like four pairs of underwear. That's as many hangers. Did you hang up your no, underwear? No, I don't know why I said that. But <laughs> I hung up like four shirts. Yeah. Where are the rest of my hangers? And she does the thing. She goes, ooh. Ooh, I can't remember. Oh, I think, yeah. oh, I think it's... Let me think a minute. What, what I think it's in the... Yeah, yeah, what hang, What do I, they I look like? I can't remember seeing any hangers. Are they... What material are they? Mm. Are they have you checked the spare? She knows she chucked them out. Yeah. Oh, I she don't, knows Grace. she chucked them I out. I don't, Grace. And then she gets upset when you have a go at her about it. I do it. not. Do you remember? No, there was, we had a domestic once. Do you remember this? I made myself cry so much. I was sick. So dramatic. But do you remember <laughs> you went through my wardrobe? I did not. Do you remember this? Went mm. through my wardrobe and chucked away when did she not go loads of stuff. And I, I don't know what happened. I opened my wardrobe and saw it and I had 
like an actual mental breakdown. Do you remember I went into your room, I was taking oh, stuff yeah, you off your hanging. I was like, Heard never to touch about. my stuff again. <laughs> and I was like crying my how, eyes out. All I could hear was your room going, thank God, thank you. I can now breathe, I have space. They didn't I say can, that. It was, it, it was didn't. like that. And this is the thing as well. Mum goes, I'm going to give away your clothes. She went to go get her eyelashes done the other day. We don't even know this woman. And she goes, I've got a box of your clothes in the back. <laughs> I'll yeah, just I give it to her. To her. Yeah, no, don't laugh. I said, if I give you these clothes. I told you not to give it I to her. I haven't given it to her. I didn't. You I bet didn't. not. I haven't. Because I threatened you in the car with that as well. <gasps> and you still. You can't threaten your own mum. Moving on from this little tate a tate your father's got something to tell everybody about stolen bikes in Newmarket. Now, you can't deny it, Oh, Reece. yeah, the right, stolen okay. bike story. We That's have skipped about four things, but Well, fine. only because I think we need to get to this as my own back. Right, can I say my version and then you say your version? Oh, you tell us your version. You of tell the us your bike. version first. It was New Year. <laughs> when I was, this was like my first ever New Year at 18 years old. I had a boyfriend and upon reflection. You had a boyfriend? Today's sponsor of the podcast is Skin and Me. Uh, if you're ever wondering how I look so good, amazing, glowy, clear, uh, dewy, the list goes on. The answer is Skin and Me. Skin and Me is your very own skincare. So what you do is you fill out the form, tell them what kind of skin type you've got, what's wrong with it, what you want to achieve. And they come up with your own formulated skincare and it's got your name on it. So you always know it's yours. You'll never get confused. In the pack, you get cleansers, moisturizers, anything that you could think of to get your whole skincare routine going. It's always important to start early because you don't want to look all wrinkly and disgusting by the time you're 32. Who is going to date someone wrinkly and disgusting? Not Leonardo DiCaprio. Not only is Skin and Me obviously efficient, but it's also sustainable, it's vegan, and it's recyclable. So basically, you will go to heaven and not hell if you use this skincare. I don't make the rules. Normally, Skin and Me is £24.99, but you can get your first month for £3.50 by using the code GRACE3. So again, if you want to get your skin started on getting clear skin, you want it ready for winter wonderland when you go on your dates, uh, use my code GRACE3 with Skin and Me for your first month for £3.50. And we were like, do you know what? We'll go out in the local town to the pub um, and there's actually a place called Innocence. Innocence? Oh, you Innocence. would have stepped right Innocence. in there. Right. Right. So yeah. underneath yeah. it, yeah, Newmarket. And you if, you, if right you know exactly what I'm talking about, you'd be like, Grace, have some respect. But underneath it is like a strip club full of like just no one wants to pay for that it's just not looking good and then above it is like a club fabulous Ooh, fabulous. fabulous yeah yeah, yeah fabulous. so anyway we have our night out with a few of his friends or whatever who i'm actually some of them are still good friends with hi brooke and then um <laughs> we basically none of us could afford a taxi home so we contemplated we were like do we get the taxi and then do just, we ring mum and dad no well, i can't no, do that because i'm with the boy one, with no. half a tooth they won't take him home so Instead, we're like, do we get the taxi and then just jump out? And I'm like, no, because I've got morals. Do I? Because then they come up with the idea, why don't we just steal some bikes from the town centre? So where were these bikes? They were just no. hanging them on? No, no, no. no. We them. were ripping them off the chains. But oh. then again, look, if you don't want your oh, bike stolen, you. get a better chain. That's what I'm saying at the end of the day. <laughs> yeah. But... I would never do that now, but it was quite funny. I was 18. But anyway, so we were ripping these bikes off. I had a child bike. I had knee high heel boots on. Was it like a get up? And yeah, yeah. Bike? I had a basket Ooh. and I was going, what the hell? So <laughs> we you all, teeth done Mom, then? we all had these bikes, right? So we all, there was about <laughs> eight of us all cycling home from a night out on these bikes we had to stop at one point this girl had asthma oh, she no. got up a hill it was do you know what it was great fun but what we didn't think about was i was drunk and i was putting on my snapchat Surely story not. i was going lol just stole some bikes <laughs> i was like how'd you get an home stolen bike like i was just putting on my story thinking it was hilarious i rise the next day and it's what I had to, when I was working at Costa, so this was, I had to do like an open, so it was half well, seven. Well, your brother had been no, ringing no. you from America saying. No, no, stop. Oh. Wait, don't get to that. Right, so, <laughs> God, stop ruining it. Right, so I wake up and we have a missed call from this boy's mum 
and it's like 7 a.m. and I've got to leave for work. So I'm getting ready for work. She goes, you're all over this page. And at the time it was called Soham Debate because where the, our area is was called Soham. So it's called Over Soham Debate. So I look on the phone and it's a screenshot of my profile with my full government name, his profile, and all the screenshots of our us stealing the bikes, right? Yeah. So at this point, I feel sick. It's, it's not going good. It's going viral, and people are co- people are making up stuff as well. They're like, they went into my garden and stole my child's bike. He's been diagnosed with cancer. I was thinking that didn't happen, but now we look really bad. It didn't happen. So anyway, I'm on my way to work. Karma strikes. Do you remember I got a flat tire? Oh yeah. I got a flat tire. At this point, my anxiety, I feel like I'm going to be sick. I'm, I'm getting cancelled. The whole neighbourhood knows I'm a thief. My dad is angry at me because I don't know how to change a tire. I'm going to be late for work. Then people start messaging my work um, being like, fire this thief. She's stealing <laughs> children who are terminally ill. But it wasn't terminally ill. They weren't even a child's bite. Anyway. So you went from bad to worse, Grace. I know. So anyway, I'd gotten away with it for a while, right? And then my brother phones me. Bearing in mind, my brother lives in New York. Okay, like he just he's ages away. He's over the sea, and he goes, "What is this that I'm seeing <laughs> online about you stealing bikes?" And at this point, if I didn't have asthma before, I did now. <laughs> I could not breathe. I was sweating. And my brother goes, "Do you know what, Grace? I'll help you out." Let me tell dad. And you know, I'll, I'll ease the blow. Yes. I'll tell him you're young. You know, you don't know what you're doing. You're easily led. And he was selling me a drink. I was going, do you know what, Ollie? You're so right. That, thank you so much. Let me rewrite my will <laughs> and add you in it. <laughs> I passed the phone to dad. And what was to come? Oh, Ali's story was so well, Yeah, you different. can tell that in a second. <laughs> but what was to come? Dad, to this oh. day, has never had a go at me like that yeah. since. Yeah. But you lost your voice for how much he was shouting at me. Yeah, no, I was like I dodging stuff <laughs> being thrown at me. I was like dodging stuff and being thrown at me. He's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh my God. So the anyway. Best, the best part about it is how Ali spoke to you and then told me something yeah so what did he different. say to you oh man i can't remember now but it it, it wasn't good no he was going this guy's a drug <laughs> dealer get under control. she's <laughs> out of control she's gonna end up in prison yeah. she's gonna end up at, i was she i was upstairs like oh he's so good he's so <laughs> what a man. i'm so lucky to have well a brother done, like Holly. him and then he i still bring this up to this day if he ever wants anything from me i'm like you remember what you did to me <laughs> but he made he did that story aside didn't he get you in the field next door and made you do oh. photographs or something so my brother photographer and whatever he he's, does, he's pretty good but yeah. those were random he's photos. a creative man so mum you and dad i think were out at the time we had to be <laughs> and ollie was like oh i've got like a project like let me take photos of you so I was at the time, I was what, seven? No, 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 you were about I was you older than that. You were about no, I couldn't have been 13. I was definitely younger than no, that. No, you, you were still in um. I was still, I was in the, in the um, I was wearing my little snow white dress. That's how young <laughs> yeah. I was. I was wearing my little snow <laughs> well, white dress. that was dress. last week. Yeah. What yeah. were you wearing the week before? No. Yeah, but you, you had a sippy uh, cup yeah. until you were I, 15. So we'll get on come to that. On. Thank <laughs> you. All right, we'll, anyway. Rude. We won't talk about that yet. So basically... Um, he gets me out there and I'm, I don't, at this point, I don't know about drugs. I don't know about smoking. I'm clueless. None of my family smoke. So he lights up a cigarette and he goes, just put it in your mouth. You don't have to inhale it. Just put it in your mouth. And I'm at the time, I'm going, I'm too scared. I'm way too, I'm going to get cancer and die. Like I'm so scared. And he goes, no, like, look, you don't have to inhale it. Just put it in your mouth. So I'm sat there like this. (laughs) With this thing, and it gets worse. He then gets flour from the kitchen <laughs> and a card and gets me to start <laughs> racking up the flour while taking a photo of me doing it, all while taking photo, putting them on Facebook. <laughs> I'm like a crackhead. I was literally nine, and you never saw those photos for ages. Well, good job, Oliver. <laughs> I thought they were iconic, job. I have to say. Well, he said to me that he thought they were one of a kind, Grace. Because yeah, no other nine-year-old is going to let them <laughs> rack up lines for a photo shoot. I was We're mental. not going there, Oliver. I'll kill you myself. Can anyway, we come back to the point of the sippy cup, which yes, I know you don't want to talk sippy about. Sippy cup. How 
that's why you hate I like I please. like a chalky milk yeah, in the morning. You, you love the chalky milk in the sippy cup. I mean, it, it went on forever. When I got fed up <laughs> doing it. You had some friends over one night. Oh, uh, no, this was cruel. Yeah, you had some friends over from Thorn <laughs> Village College. All right, don't drop the whole government. Look, <laughs> Sorry. you were really old. I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said that. that. Yeah. But you had some friends over from high school, and you um, you guys were up in the room, and you were watching a movie, and you said, oh, should we have some and chocolate sleep milk? Over, didn't yeah. I and sleep over, didn't you? Yeah, and I, I said, well, how many how many glasses of chocolate milk? And you said, well, four. There's four of us there. We all want it. Nobody's allergic to anything. And then I, I started making yours in a sippy cup. <laughs> in your favorite sippy cup. Uh, it, was lemon, it was a lemon color. Lemon color. Yeah, it was a lemon little color. Little teeth marks. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you came down to help me carry them up. And when you saw the sippy cup, you went, no. <laughs> And I'm saying, well, what, what, you don't want it in your sippy cup. You, you love it in your sippy cup. Your favorite sippy cup. You never had it after that. No, that no, actually no, stopped her. Time, I'm limiting it. That was the end of that. Was, She was 15. Or I wasn't. I was not 15. You, you were, 15. were No, Grace. Do you remember when I pissed myself on Louise's windowsill? Uh, I no. think that's another story we weren't going to bring up, but carry on. Yeah, no, <laughs> what, this is the most embarrassing thing that has ever happened to me in my life. Sorry, I just remembered it. I don't think so. You but... were there. Do you remember you were there? Mum was there. So I was around my friend's house. Selective memory coming on. No, on. I was around my friend's house. We were playing hide and seek and you were in the kitchen with her mum. Um, we were with her, you were with her mum or whatever. And I was... Was hiding. I in a glass of wine? No, you oh. were. I don't know what bloody hell you're doing, but you're doing something. <laughs> and I was on the windowsill hiding, playing hide and seek. And I remember being like, oh, like, I really need a wee. Grace. But I was like, no, I cannot give up my spot. This is really good. I'm winning this game. And you know when it hurts? And oh, you're like, really when know. you hold in for too long and it hurts. Yeah. And you're like, oh, no, like, I actually have to let this go. Like, if I don't, I'll implode. So I just pissed myself on her window. Mum, you were there. Pissed myself on her windowsill. It went everywhere. And I had to do the walk of shame into the kitchen with you there. I can't remember And that. I had to go. Was her name what? Sally? Was it? What was her mum's name? Uh, I don't remember, but I had to go. I And I was older at this point. I had to have been like 11. I was like, I've wet myself. And you all started laughing. And I was like, <laughs> no. Me. And I was like, no, seriously, I've wet myself. And you were like, wah, wah, and I turned around and you were like, <laughs> and the laughter stopped. And you were like, yeah, no, she has wet herself. You have to take me home. <laughs> how embarrassing that was <laughs> I, I can't believe you've it, blocked Grace. that out you've blocked that out I should have blocked that out I think I have to block a lot out Grace otherwise I'd, I wouldn't be sane you'd be taking up the uh, mental health services <laughs> the NHS if you didn't um, mind you you used to take for car rides and not tell me about it and spin cars and things. wait wait do you want another drink before we do this story oh yes what car did you used to have the red one? Oh, it was a Mazda RX-7 right and this was it no was it was this one, was it red or grey? Uh, it was the red one. You know, right. The grey one. And it had like the bucket said. seats, it did a little fire out the back. Yeah. We yeah. thought we were the bee's knees in that. We used to listen to Black Eyed Peas really loud. Yeah. That was my childhood. But anyway, one day we're driving home yeah. from, I don't know where we were, but we were driving home. I think he picked you up from school. I'm still kind of stuck on, did we stop listening to Black Eyed Peas? No, we never did. We just no, carried on. We yeah, did. we're keeping yeah, we're them in business, yeah. kind of. Anyway, so we were about to turn a corner. And to be fair, Dad does this thing where he'll he'll do some rogue stuff in the car. And he's like, oh, like tricks or whatever, right? And it's usually fine. He took this corner so fast. All I remember is it spinning. How many times does this car spin? It was a wide open corner. You could see cars coming from. No, you sides. could. That was I, such was a lie. He, it was such an accident. We like <laughs> span three times. I was. If you saw it in slow motion, you could just see. Could me you see like, through the gap? No, there was no. Oh, yeah, I probably didn't have a gap at that point. But like, it was just me screaming, and then it it, it came to a halt. We were on the grass. We'd gone fully off the road and what on was the, the grass. Thing you said? Did we go on the grass? I can't remember. Don't yes, we did. The no. And then he looked at me, and I was like, "I just escaped death." And you said to me, "You said," and I said, "Don't tell your mum." No, yeah, uh, yeah. But yeah. It but all you in slow no, no. This was after it stopped. <laughs> he just went, "Don't tell your mum," and I was like, "Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll do that. No, but yeah. no, no." I was like, "You wouldn't do that." Yeah. 
So we get to the front door. And the door opens. You say, oh, you're home. And then what Grace says, you won't believe what just happened. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't Ollie you did spin it all you. The didn't time. Ollie pick you up from school and spun the white, you had a um, white, um, what do we have? Uh, Nissan, yeah. Nissan, yeah. Did he? He came to pick we, you up and he spun in the same place that Dad did, I think, along the Did hedges. he? Were you there? No, no, no. no. He came he, to pick you up. Pick you up from school when you were a lot younger. Who on earth thought that was a good idea? I taught him out to drive. Oh, well, it was go, like yeah, being yeah, in, you know hell? that thing when he's in Andrew? It was mm-hmm. like being in Australia with him because all the car kept doing was that. What does that even mean? What <laughs> it means that he can't drive. <laughs> All the gears, he was kangarooing it. We uh, call it kangarooing right, okay, it all yeah, the way. Yeah. He was absolutely, well, you know. It you took know, him like seven times well, to you pass. know, Oliver was well known by first name terms at the driving centre. Of course. <laughs> Every time he yeah, went to I think he feel like seven eight? times, wasn't it? Yeah, seven? I think it was seven I don't times. Know, and he has an excuse yeah. for each one. He, he was like, there was a the tropical test. storm. Hi, Ollie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think you did a bit better than that. After Ollie had said I wasn't going to teach you how to drive. I couldn't do it no, I don't. No, you didn't really. Well, you no, were right. You, you passed second time. Second time, yeah. Mm. The theory was four. We don't talk about that. Yeah, we won't talk about nah, that. No, because we. I forgot my ID. One of the days we got all the so way to Berry three, three yeah. times. Oh, yes. And do you remember we got there, and you went, "You got your driver's license," and I went, "No, I thought you had it." It's like you going to on holiday without your passport. Yeah, yeah no, but like. And we were like, I'm not telling mum. <laughs> you tell mum. I'm not telling mum. You're fuming. I should have had my revenge then. Yeah, what was yeah. that? You did. What are you talking about? Should have. You were like, Grace I probably did, forgot yeah. her pass, not yeah. passport, her ID. Yeah. <gasps> right, I'm not asking the first one. Second one. Well, what is the first no, one? No, we're not asking that. Oh, go on. Where no, we're not well, asking that. Well, you've said it now. So no, I'm not, I'm well, not asking the first one. Tell us what it is. Well, we tell us what it's about. It, but... We won't go for it. Nah, because I'll kill myself. Oh, uh, uh, ask us it. Ask it. Who put, who put 50p in you, Cal? I don't see you asking your parents this question. Right, come along. Ask yeah, us. <laughs> okay. Have you... Wait. Huh? Have you... Yeah. Is it him or me? Have Both. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, have you... Yeah. My eyelash is stuck. Ever heard... Heard or had? Heard. <laughs> yeah. Me... What? <laughs> Just don't answer it. With a man. Oh, yes, we have. <laughs> <laughs> yes. No, next question. Uh, I'm not sure. Next question. Yeah, to the dad. Sure. Have you ever not liked any of Grace's men? Uh, uh, did you? What about, I would tell about say the, when you went out with the axe? Oh, my God. Yes, yeah, so you went out with an axe. of uh, the guys you've dated. No. You, you, you finally dated somebody that's actually decent. No, Thank you. But, yes, yeah. but hang on a minute. Tell them about having about the axe. You went out there and said, is this you? Is this your car? <laughs> yeah. Is it, has it, it was got an a MOT? Joke, it was just a joke. It shouldn't have been they a joke. Upon hindsight, you should have actually went through with yeah, it. Exactly. Jesus Christ. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, no, yeah, because you went to the window of an axe. You were like, no, you? It, I th- no, Andrew went out there with an axe, but I pre-warned yeah, him. Up, that-, uh, it, it, that, that then boyfriend, I, don't, I can't even remember what his name was. Oh, he I pulled mean. up on the sidewalk in front of the house. <laughs> <laughs> and I walked out with an axe because he never actually blew his horn. I don't know if he, he messaged just turned up. It was 10 p.m. Grace. It was 10 p.m. Yeah, and it was 10 p.m. No, so I just walked out. Yeah, do you remember he was taking me to the beach? Uh, I walked out with an axe, knocked to the window, and said, "You want something?" <laughs> <laughs> with the axe. <laughs> and then he went, "I'm here to see Grace." <laughs> Grace. He, he said, never came Grace. Back. Um, next question. Oh yes. First thought. First four, four, four. first thoughts on Grace's career. Don't understand it. <laughs> <laughs> Neither do I. Why would anybody sit and listen to you talk rubbish all day long? What the hell? Well, apart from this podcast, this is the most interesting yeah, one except, of all except for this time. One. Fine. Except for um, this one. Well, you were saying about the first time that you saw one of my videos. I like it. I right. like it. Yeah. Don't, yeah. It's all right. It's all good. It's all good. So you can talk about the time that. I showed you your first video. Well, on here or no, the one we were just talking about. Tiger King. Yeah. Tiger oh. King. Well, I have to say, Grace, the first time that we thought you had actually had some pretty cool talent was when That was fu- the worst thing I ever had in my life. When you That was awful. When pretty you cool did 
Tiger King. Yeah. And it was so good that Dad and I actually, we had to look at it about 20 times and say, she's got it, yeah, she? she's got I it. Yeah, I thought it was really funny. It was really funny. Yeah. It was in time. Yeah. It was perfect. And when we you thought, see this, Where's the bars this come on the floor, from? you're going to be so mm. underwhelmed. No, it was blooming funny, but it was excellent. Yeah. So we, we knew then there could be something here. Right. And now what do you think? There could be something here. Am I your favourite child? Uh, it depends. That's a yes. Are you taking me out for dinner after this? Yeah, I might do. Okay, you're my favourite child. Yeah. <laughs> I always say 60-40 in the world to me. Uh, but you can't a... count anyway. You no, you're useless with Yeah, I'll compare the pay slips. Who's getting the 60 who's getting the Me. 40? Ooh. You're getting which one? I'm getting 60. She had to think uh, about it. <laughs> Ollie can have the 40. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 40 right. more. How did you both meet? Oh, how did we both meet? Talking to the mic, Mum. Otherwise, oh. you can't hear it properly. Who, who do you want to answer this? You I'm can. not answering that question. <laughs> 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 well, look, first of all, may I say... So. If, wait, wait, wait. In, the, in this show, on your podcast, yeah. if you don't want to answer the question, you just have a drink. Well, yeah, but Mum can answer it just while you drink. drink. No, so somebody has to answer a question, which I'm going to do, but I've got to be very careful here. Just have a drink. Because, yeah. No, 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 I can't have <laughs> Look at you, you're drink. terrified. So how do we first meet? Um... So when your actual dad, so when your mm. father and I were living in um, Virgin Gorda, yeah, uh, I met Andrew because you, Andrew, dad Andrew was a fireman, f a paramedic. Can you quickly before you carry on? Can you quickly do the story where you first saw him and dad nearly crashed? I didn't. That wasn't when we first saw oh, him. We met, not? and he was doing. He, he had glasses on, and I thought he looked like something out a milk box. Oh, I had those big glasses. <laughs> he had huge. Big, he had huge glasses that he didn't want me to see. And I didn't he was want driving to see me with them. So uh, she was driving this way, and I was driving that way. You're driving a fire truck as well. Off. Glasses off. <laughs> then I consider the road. I thought, what the hell just happened? <laughs> I don't know, I don't right, know how so, I didn't drive into <laughs> yeah. Carol will have to cut this or do whatever he wants. But basically, we first met because you were in our, uh, we, Andrew, were in our social group that we met when we were in the Virgin Islands. You were in the same social circle? Yes, yeah. And you've never Maybe looked back. Maybe you should play some elevator music through her talking. <laughs> yeah. No, but I mean, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I don't know what to say really because I've got to be a bit careful. We've never looked back since. No, anyway. No. Well, you know, look forward. Well, tell them. Right. Most shameless memory of Grace? Poo. Yeah, definitely poo. I have been diagnosed <laughs> officially with poop DSD. <laughs> yeah. It's similar to PTSD. Yeah, but with but poo. But it's poop. Yeah. No, it's just yeah. poop. Yeah, he's not the same. I hope Billy's not watching this. And anybody says anything about poop, I start retching. <laughs> I mean, no last cure. night, Grace. No, I mean, we're not going okay. there. There's God. no cure and it's terminal. So. <laughs> yeah, it is. Amen. Yeah. All right. right. Individually, what is your most embarrassing child memory? <laughs> um, most embarrassing? What, for us? Yeah. With you? Uh, do, what do they mean by that? Or for yourselves? Or for me? Oh, for me. Um, ooh. I have one. Mm. Uh, you used to like. Oh, don't uh, say talking it. Talking and pretending oh, okay. to know different languages. <gasps> yes. And you were very good oh, at it. Oh, my God. Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, we were walking through Tesco's. I think this was the beginning of your career. Yeah, we were walking through Tesco's and you decided you were French that day. <laughs> so you were talking to me in French constantly. <laughs> well, but it wasn't actual French. French. French lady walked up and said, Oh, is your daughter French? And I just looked at her and said, oh, are you French? And she said, yes. And I said, can you tell? She's just talking gibberish. <laughs> she, what was it that you know? But to you. I would say but like random words. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> like walking around constantly, but it would be really yeah. good at the time. It would sound like I was being One day French. it'll be French. Another day it'll be Irish. Yeah. Uh, another time it'll be, I have no clue what it was, but you know, it'll be. Something controversial probably. Yeah. 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 It's weird. Yeah, you and I couldn't always, shut you up. You yeah. just well, you could always pick an it. audience. That was with you, Grace. I mean, you you be in some wherever you be, and you just pick a moment, and then you'll do something. And we're all going. Is that really happen? <laughs> 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 yeah, I, I, I still can't did, do actually. that to this day. <laughs> I can't read the room. 
<laughs> you can never read the room. No, I can't think of anything in particular because they're all awful. So yeah. I, I really can't. And there was think... another one that was. God, Dad's got of, them all up his sleeve. It was funny, but How it was also a little, little bit embarrassing where they were, they were playing some um, uh, calypso music. In the calypso, oh, yes. And we were in this bar, and I don't know what came over, but you started to dance like a pole dancer, and you were about <gasps> four. <laughs> <laughs> So I don't know where you learned that from. What? <laughs> I didn't know about yeah, you this. Did. You did. You, you were trying to dance like the local. Oh, and, yeah. You were trying to do the moves. Yeah, you, you were trying, trying to do the moves. The moves. It yeah. looked a bit like a pole dancer <laughs> who had, had too much crack cocaine or something. <laughs> yeah. 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 I get told that a lot, actually. Grace. Jokes. Mm. <laughs> yeah. I remember people saying, oh, she's good. And I'm going, yeah, yeah. Oh, please stop that, Grace. I was, like, <laughs> I was just thinking, please stop. I didn't even remember that, so yeah. I'm embarrassed now. Um, first time you saw her drunk, me drunk. Oh, that's easy. Easy. I mean, really drunk. Uh, picked you up from one of your friends who lived not too far away. Mm -hmm. And uh, Is that when she goes, I don't want to put her no, no, but you, 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 I don't remember that either. You were in, a, uh, you were in one of your weird uh, sort of moods, and you'd say, Oh, she has a. Uh, I think your friend was about 20 and already had a house, and um, and you didn't have a boyfriend at the time, and she had a boyfriend. She said, Who oh, could this have been? I can't remember. It was uh, near Red Lodge. Oh, you know that. Oh, Brooke. And you, you, um, you Hello, said, Brooke. God, that was only last, <laughs> last month. No, it wasn't I last month. December? No, it was Ma a couple of years ago. No, sir. A couple of years ago. He said, how come I don't have a boyfriend? Am I not attractive, Dad? And, <gasps> and, you know, uh? and he got home and I just said, I'm going to leave you to get into the house and you. <laughs> and you got out the car and fell face first into the gravel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can't yeah, left it yeah, for a little bit. When I was with Emily, do you remember Emily? I was doing just shots of that Glenn vodka in the car, <gasps> Glenn's vodka in the car. And I was like, you want some? And you were like, I'm literally driving. Oh, yeah. You were trying to feed me shots. No, that was Dad that would other. almost yeah. pick you up. Yeah. 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 You wouldn't. You just leave me on the street. Like, yeah, more. I, like I mean, really me. paralytic. <laughs> you have or haven't? Have. Yeah. 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 I I mean, the thing is with you, Grace, is when you've had a few jars... You're all right. You're all funny and that. And then suddenly you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And you like, yeah, you everything stop. stops. And you're like, rigor mortis is set. <laughs> and you're like that. And then it's like. <gasps> <laughs> yeah. And then Says we you. have to leave you. We have to leave you. We have to leave you because nothing will wake you. You know? I remember when I was younger, you. We put flies in our mouth. For you time. made me my first ever pims, but it was a jug. Do you remember this? You made me my first no, ever jug. I pim. made the jug. For us. Yeah. And you decided. I drank. Oh, I remember that no, one. No, I remember that I one, I drank yeah. the entire jug. Oh, Grace. And I was so violently unwell. I think unwell. we've all had times in our lives where there's one specific bit of drink that you whack back and you yeah. think, oh, never, I, I can't touch I couldn't drink that again. for a yeah, while. Yeah, exactly. Mine was, when I was 13, I, stupidly, um, I did enjoy it at the time. Bacardi, I cannot. 13? You were drinking Bacardi? Well. Mum, mum and dad didn't know, but <laughs> I will never get over. I took a, a bottle of Bacardi, half, half a bottle of Bacardi. And I'm mm, right. yeah, this is really good, isn't it? And, and grandpa's going, oh, oh, oh she's going to be terrible in the morning. And I was. And do you know what? To this day, I still can't <laughs> sniff it. I can't go anywhere near it. Yeah. Oh, I've, I've seen many a time when you can't go near anything because you've drunk everything. Yeah, mine was peach snaps. I had a boyfriend at the time. I threw up in his bin. You the next day, I threw up in his bin the actually, next day. Actually, Grace, I think you've done that more than once. No, I don't like sick, Mum. I'm actually quite good. In your in your uni houses, there's been some disgusting dis finds in yeah, bins. Yeah, yeah, true, yeah. true. Mostly in your bedroom. Yeah. I like guess so. sucker, yeah, uni ah! house. What? what? <laughs> Did you scream? It was one on one year podcast. I, I was kind of interested. Oh, Nothing happened. I don't know <laughs> Are you ever going to confess? What he's talking about? <laughs> Considering I still have to cut your toenails, Mom. it could be very serious. Look, someone's going to do it. I'm not doing <laughs> it. Yeah, that's one weird thing about this family: this uh, toenail cutting and. Well, you don't. Brother cut. still gets you his done. Don't cut your yeah, toenails. You do it. You do it. If you didn't do it, I would do it. I you get my toes. I get my toes done now. Your toenails. No, if you didn't don't. cut, would be like I that. I get no. I get my toes done now. <laughs> 
Only because I'll ring them up and say, no, for Christ's sake, cut their bloody toenails. No, we're moving on to the next one. <laughs> now I'm old. I can't believe you just brought up toe sucking. I'm mortified. Anyway, right. moving swiftly what on. Hell? What else? Are, any other questions, Grace? Moving on to Billy. Oh, uh, yes, Billy. CCTV. Oh, my God. So I want your point of view. Well, it's very easy, actually. We laughed our heads off. So I invite Billy round. No, first of all, yeah. I, the, your father and I were going on a not very often vacation to somewhere. Yeah. Uh, Italy. And uh, we <laughs> what is it that's in your bio? <laughs> what's in your bio? Well, what's in Anything. What? What, what's the bio? Oh, in the bio. Anything including Umbria. Umbria. I love Umbria. Oh, yeah. Anything to do with Umbria. Well, I love it. Love it. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, bio. Anyway, carry about on. Bio. You talk about washing powder. No, or what? the but <laughs> get on with it. <laughs> All right, all right, sure. Sure. So basically, we went on holiday, and for four days we had the most wonderful trip. However, during that time, Dad decided to have a check on the old cameras. Well, let, let me do my thing. We so I they were going on holiday, and originally it was meant to be Tat staying with me, <laughs> and um, she did for a bit. And then I was still speaking to Billy. I've been on a few dates with him at this point. He was a uh, boyfriend, not boyfriend. He yet, was my man. Who is my man? Who wasn't my man, but was my man. So I was, and he was like, oh, miss you. And I was like, oh, miss you too. I don't have parents here. So he was like, oh, I'll come see you. And I was like, yeah, fine. So he brought me my favorite donuts, a wine. And we I'm were like, myself. I we myself. were like, oh, like they'll never know. How would they know? <laughs> Like because we've been there, done that. Oh, no. <laughs> well, no, because originally we had fake CCTV. I can say this now because it's real now. Yeah. But at the time yeah, we, we had fake CCTV cameras to put people off. So I just assumed they were still fake. And so what go else on to, do you yeah. not assume? Yeah, so what else have you assumed that it's... <laughs> yeah. So while we were on holiday, every day, uh, you know, oh, there were some days that you said that you weren't going to be there. Yes, we had to have a check, you so know. I thought, oh, I'll just have a yes, look at we had CCTV. To have a check. Yeah. Just to check. And, and then uh, all of a sudden yeah. he said, oh, that's funny. He said, There's I didn't a... actually see you and Billy, but I saw his car parked in the driveway. Yeah. And uh, yeah. And then when we when we got back, you said you're going to introduce us to Billy a few weeks yeah. later. And when Billy he pulled up in the drive, he to said to me, car. <laughs> looks like a bloody same car to me. And I'm yeah. thinking, watch this space. So, Well, Billy's going, wow. Look I have this. never seen what? acting. Have you done this? this I have never seen acting. Brilliant. In fact, he's a better actor than you. Yeah. And he did very well. But then he went upstairs he to went, the bathroom. Nobody goes upstairs no, to the bathroom. That's Area 51. No one knows what's up there. No one goes up no there. No one's allowed up there. No what's one's allowed on? up no one there. Knows. And there's one downstairs. It was there's kind one of downstairs. Yeah. So I'm was thinking, so I, said to, I said to Drew, he's he blown it. He's upstairs, blown it. Yeah. He's yeah. blown it. So when he came downstairs, we went, he walked well, in the kitchen. Well, you and I decided to wait and see how far well, they'd carry we, it. Well, we were yeah. very, very we decided, enamored let's see how far they marketing carry this. skills. Mm. Yeah, the, the acting was really good. Yeah, yeah. it was very good, Drew. Uh, yeah. And actually, that, uh, Grace says was... No, and do you know what's so bad? They went, has, uh, has Billy been here before? And I went, no, no. I swear on Monty's life. <laughs> yeah. Monty's I would, a cat, by the yeah, way. Yeah, but he's also 15. So if I do he's swear dead, on his life, he's dying anyway. <laughs> he's 18. Actually. He's 18. Yeah. He's 18. Yeah. He's 18. One more line, he is dead. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I didn't know that boy was 18. That is taking the piss. Shut up, Carl. Stop laughing. Right. But so I did, I thought they'll believe that because I really love the cat. So straight away, they just wouldn't question it. Well, it wasn't that. He came back in and he went, oh, yes, I love this lime kitchen. Um, Said no one ever, by the way, the most disgusting kitchen ever. It's not disgusting, it is. Right? It's, it's awful. It's got taste. Ask the general public. Different. It's good for drinking. It's not yeah. good for hangovers. It's yeah. good for hangovers. Anyway. No, it's not good for hangovers. I thought you two did really well. Thank First you. of all, he comes in and he went, what? What? We hadn't said Oh, because he heard me scream. Because I'd been caught out and I just started screaming again, as you've heard throughout all of this podcast. <laughs> I just started screaming. And then he came down and he said, Grace, what? <laughs> and we said, have you been here before, Billy? And he went, 
I have. <laughs> <laughs> he folded straight away. And yeah. he, he is no, uh, first of all, I'm not employing him as a yeah. burglar yeah. or anything like that. He's too blinking soft. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know, he, he just, he's just a giveaway. Yeah. So he's obviously off the books for the family for any burglaries. But I actually thought that your both your acting skills were in front of us were very well, good. Well, jokes on him because the next day I had to go to our granddad's funeral. <laughs> he only came to drop me home. So we had met him we'd only met him well first of all we caught him out and then uh, he'd come to drop grace off and that was on the thursday and um unfortunately my, my father passed away and we are you I'm laughing, sure, I, don't laughing oh. at. Yeah. I don't know what i'm laughing at but he's actually quite hilarious <laughs> so basically what happened was we'd not met billy before grace said oh can billy um he's gonna she, he's gonna drop me off i said oh fine that was on the thursday the funeral was on the friday and he he said, didn't eat till the Sunday. He didn't eat till no. the Sunday. So he came to the funeral in <laughs> Andrew's shirt. Um, I don't know what I'm And Balenciagas. <laughs> he wore Balenciagas and a pink he, shirt. Then he met my mum. So we had, you know, all the rigmarole with the funeral. So he turned up at the house. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, and, uh, my God. This is another story. So basically. Grace's grandma called him Willie. 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 She Hello, call him Willie. Willie. Hello, and we're Billy. thinking, we're off to a good start. Yeah. <laughs> well, she remember it and she still calls him. He said, when am I going to eat Willie again? <laughs> um, so basically, to, and then when we were at the church, at the the crematorium, oh. to do, first of all, Grace. No, I Grace, can't. I don't know what happened No, here. first of all, I can't deal with death full stop. It makes me feel physically sick. Seeing a coffin makes me feel violently no, it unwell. Yeah, it was a wicker coffin. Yeah, it was a wicker coffin. Good for the coffin. It's still disgusting. There's a dead body in it. Oh, but and it, I know the dead body, yeah, so it's even worse. First of all, you heard a no, rustling. So I didn't hear a rustling. They got him out of the bloody car, and I hear a like a thump. And I look at Billy, and I go, it wasn't, was it? And he goes, no. It was. And afterwards, he's going lightheaded at this point. Well, the problem we had was the vicar... Didn't know this anything. Vicar. The vicar didn't know anything about I Billy. Can't. So I'm and he, so I'm saying, "Hello, Ruth." Um, and here we all are. And yes, we're going to go in. She said, "Now, what I want you to? Who's this chap?" Um, and she thought he was Oliver. Yeah, everyone kept going. You're right, Ollie. And I'm, going, right, I'm not Ollie? dating my brother. That's disgusting. I'm so, holding Oliver. hands with him. And so I then said to her, "Actually, Ruth, um, we live in the country. He's but new yeah, on the scene. Normal, His name's Billy." And she went. Okay. <laughs> so we, we, we all walk up after Dad. Billy sits in the wrong place. Billy sits in the he wrong sits place. He sits in the wrong row. I'm going, get up. He's going, sit down. I'm going, Grace get is, up. We're in the wrong Grace place. Grace is in cerise pink with a nice little number of the same sort of shoes she's got on now. Yeah. All suitable for a funeral. It was see for as well. There's my dad rustling in the, in the front in his coffin. Like yeah. This. <laughs> and then she decides, oh, hang on a minute. I haven't been to a funeral before. <laughs> I start hysterically so she crying. She starts crying. I'm thinking... Right. I'm right. recording this video for mum as well, her speech, and all you can hear is me go. <laughs> 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 right. Billy's just getting tissues every five oh. minutes. I'm like, <laughs> anyway, so we got through all that. Yeah. And then we got back to the uh, after bit, and all you could hear the my afters. mum was saying, Oh, you don't get much for your sherry these days, do you? <laughs> of course, her husband's dead. She sat there worrying about the sherry. She says, I think these glasses are a bit small. How much are they charging? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we got through all that, and um, yeah, apart yeah, from that, tell them about when uh, Grandpa died. The what? When oh Grandpa my God, died. I've got to do this. Oh, so what yeah. happened was? Oh, this was I can't believe. I am Grace's biggest fan. Seriously, apart from her bedroom, but apart from that, <laughs> Thank you. I think she's great. Anyway, while we're at, while um, my father was still warm in his bedroom, literally, the. They had to go through a bit of protocol and the police had to be called because your grandfather was Suspicious like death. He was 95. No, no. It wasn't a natural and death. He died, like, in, he his died in his sleep. Uh, so it was like, had he been to the doctor? I don't know. No. Right. Anyway, so this chap turns up, very nice chap, a you know, policeman. And uh, he turns up this, funny enough, he had a bin bag and I thought, Christ, he's got Grace's nappies in it. <laughs> and all it was, was, it was a massive bin bag and they had to take Dad's medication away. And he oh, I thought they were four. going to put Grandpa in it. Well, I, I was like, what? And he had four pills. It's ridiculous. Yeah. Anyway, he's sitting in the kitchen and he's doing all his paperwork and he's going, hmm, hmm, hmm. Grandma's away with the fairies because she started on the sherry by that time. That yeah, was about 9 past nine in the morning. Yeah. yeah. 
And then there was the ambulance people there and they were going, everything all right? <laughs> yeah, all marvellous. So in the end, Grace rang and she said, oh, I just thought I'd speak to Grandma. Oh, yes, here we are. You all right, Grandma? <gasps> I think I'm, yeah. Oh, that's good then. Pass me back to Mum. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, I, so are you all right then? Yeah, okay. Uh, so what's happening now then? Well, we've got a chap in the kitchen. He's doing all the paperwork. Oh, what's he doing then? Oh, he's a policeman. Oh, yeah. Does he know about you, Grace? I don't know. I'll find out. So I put the phone down. I said, oh, it must be really mundane what you're doing. He said, oh, it's all bloody paperwork. I said, here, I'll tell you what. If you seen her before, and I put this, uh, got your podcast out. <laughs> oh, and he said, this is a bit interesting, isn't it? So he put down all the paperwork. They got all that out. Got, got all the Grace stuff out. Oh, he said, is this your daughter? I said, yeah, she's just rung. He said, oh, I bloody like this. <laughs> oh, I don't know what happened, but he was on there for about 25 minutes. <laughs> He said that um, you're very entertaining. Yeah. I don't watch your podcast myself, but Mum's he banned it. from it. Hey, my, you're banned from watching my podcast. I well, know I don't watch. But it. I got in the car the other day. Dad was taking me home from uni, and he was listening to the Danny D episode. So I was like, "Well, it's too bleeding late." Going some, through all the episodes. Is yeah. this a porn person? Yeah. Is it porn? half man, half horse? But is his stage it's name? It's not porn when you pawn your jewellery. No, it's porn when you're Thank naughty. You. Okay. Next question. What is the goat save? Oh, we've done that. Right. So my final question to you, but anything you want to add quickly before I... No, I think they've fallen asleep now. Right. Yeah. That's anything else? No, no, you go ahead. My last question that I ask everyone, Are we, uh, if you, and do not say anything about poo, this is banned. You can't okay, say anything okay, about poo okay. in this question. If you had any tip to save me, saving Grace, any tips for me, what would it be? Oh, uh, that's a good question. Yeah, Thank it's you. a good question. Yeah. No. You want to go first? No, because I can't think of anything. No, saving grace. Any tips to make my me better? There's so much that you cut your there fingernails, is. cut your toenails. Well, right? obviously, clean your room. Clean. You've uh, got to. You've got to be a bit more on hygiene, Grace. Mum, you can't be saying Did that. You, not, you can't what? be saying I'm cutting that. Say something else. I'm cutting it. Cut. Yeah, tick. Why, why, why are you cutting that? I'm but? cutting that. Well, um, what what else like to say? Oh yeah, I had a tick in my head. Have that wasn't me. I was in a field. As a daughter, has made me regret having girlfriends when I was younger because I, I think I probably picked up diseases or something. <laughs> that's probably undiagnosed. Brilliant. Yeah, you know, probably. Think, yeah. Yeah, you know, you think, <laughs> when you're younger, you, you meet some girl and you, you're kissing. You say, Oh, oh fantastic. God, oh girl. God. No, I she think, just cut her toenails. No, I think oh, I shouldn't have done that. You know, <laughs> talk about sex, I kind of think. <laughs> she's never done that. But yeah, I know. Grace, I've I have violated. to say, all I need you to do is learn how to use a washing machine. I do know how to use a washing machine. Are you I'm on a, a fr- uni? Well, Grace. no. Fine. <laughs> <laughs> right. Thank what? you. No, no. You're going to say no. Thank you for coming on. <laughs> oh, that's a minute. I hate you all. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I need the rest of my drink. I'm sweating <laughs> profusely. <laughs> now, how was it? Yeah, sorry. Um, everyone started clapping, so I was like, it's done now. Uh, right. Yeah, thanks for watching. If you are watching, make sure you give it a like and subscribe. And if you're listening, give it a five-star review and a follow. So peace sign. Right. <laughs>